Hi everyone. Hope you all are doing well. Today I am going to show how to use regular expressions for a variable without scripting. That means like without um, writing any on on change or on load client script. How can we use regular expressions on a catalog item variable? Let's see. Log in to your personal instance or customer instance. OK, so here I have a one item called um, Apple iPhone 13. OK, so if I open this Apple iPhone 13, I have some variables. OK, for example, if I click on this one as it shows me what was the original phone number. OK, if I enter uh, like any number, any digits and number, then this is not an original phone number. It's not like a phone number, okay? Phone number contains only numbers. So if I uh, come back, then it throws me an error that enter valid phone number in format plus jet jet x x x x. That means like in the plus country code and number like that. For example, if I enter any number, okay? And it show it throws me an error. Okay, any number, only number. It throws me an error because I did not use plus sign or country record. Okay, let's cancel this one. And uh, if I click on like plus sign and number, only number. Okay, then it will take. Okay, so how I have written this code. This code I have written like on change of um, what was the original phone number client script. OK, so I will show you the client script. Go to the maintain items. Go to. Appeal iPhone 13. OK. Here I have written one catalog landscape called number validation. OK, so on change of the phone number, a script will check that, OK, a regress expression. OK, this will check it is having a plus symbol and number only number. OK, if not, then it will throw me error. This is we are writing some on change client script or something. OK, we can achieve this without this client script also. Let's see how to achieve this one. OK, uh, just you need to do is you need to copy the regress number. OK. The regress number. OK, let's go to go back. OK, and before OK. And I will deactivate my number validation to false. OK, and now I will go to Apple iPhone 13, refresh it. Refresh it. And if I enter anything, it is taking. OK, uh, there is no validation now. Now, how to do this validation? OK, directly without scripting. Go to the variables. Okay, go to uh, the variable which you want to have regular expression like phone number. Open this phone, open this one. Okay, so under type specifications, you have validation regress. Okay, so here you need to select, uh, for example, email or IP address, number, URL, US chip code. So these validations we don't have. Okay, so create one validation request. Okay, so to create this, go to the catalog. Variable validation request. OK, open this one. OK, and now create a new. OK, just add like a number. Whatever the uh, whatever you like, like name. OK, and regular expression paste this one. 
and in the year you should not enclose in uh, slash f okay and regress okay insensitive okay unicode case okay we will select like both so what is the validation method validation message is like um, same enter the valid phone number in okay enter the valid phone number and submit it okay now go back to here okay or refresh it okay so after refreshing it so in this validation regress okay you will get number the one which we have written called number okay so there is already one number okay and save it okay now go to your catalog item and refresh it now select okay phone number now type only numeric so now it is throwing an enter the valid phone number okay it's a validation okay if you submit also it will not allow it will not allow you to submit okay even if the value is there okay and if you are going to submit it will not allow okay it will not allow to submit okay if i write only the number again same enter the valid phone number so if i add plus so it will allow me and then if i order now then it is going to submit it okay so that is how we need to write okay regular expressions in catalog okay so without having without creating new client scripts or ui policies anything okay without scripting we can use these okay regular expressions questions okay yeah that's it thank you please do subscribe to get alerts for upcoming videos hope you will enjoy online service now thank you very much for your time